Shalom to the elect. I'm going to start by giving all the praise, honor, and glory to whom it rightfully belongs, which is Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Right, Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Right, Yahweh is the one the world ain't really calls God. Yah means He, and Hawa means to be or exist. So Yahweh's name means He is, or He to be, or He exists. All right? And Yahweh is not a so called white man, He's a so called black man. All right? Bahasham means in the name. Ba means in. Ha means the. And Shum means name. Yahweh Shai is the true name of the Messiah. Yahweh Shai is the one. Yahweh Shai is the one the world ignorantly calls Jesus. Yah meaning he. And Yahweh Shai meaning save or deliver. So Yahweh Shai's name means he is the savior or he is the deliverer. All right? Yahweh Shai also is not a so called white man. He's a so called black man. Bahasham once again meaning in the name. And Rechal Kodash meaning Holy Spirit. Rechal meaning spirit and Kodash meaning holy. So I said all the praises, honor, and glory belongs to Yahweh in the name of Yahweh Shai and the name of the Holy Spirit. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone at Ruel. Peace, blessings, and salutations to the elect. And this lesson is entitled, um, you know, Salakia. Yeah, this lesson pretty much, you know, going into, um, because I was just meditating, man, you know, in the supermarket. You know, you know, late night, just run errands and shit, right? You know, just, um, I was meditating, man, a quick thought, you know, and the thing is, you know, pretty much, I'm a Lord will entitle this lesson to something along the lines of, you know, the elect, the elect men, and all, are really, uh, pretty much, a lot of women are going to be chasing the elect men. When all hell breaks loose, okay? A lot, man. All right? Man, you know, like the apostles say, you know, um, you know, the apostles say, man, that, uh, you know, we're going to have to beat them off, off us with a stick. Right? Lord willing, you know, we are the elect. You know, people in the world, you know, wouldn't, wouldn't agree with us, but it doesn't matter because it's prophecy, right? But I was just meditating, right? Because you have... Think about it, man. The elect, right, are scattered. And it's only a few of the elect. All right, the elect is, you know, it's, 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 elect is a big number, but, you know, also compared to the people around, around us, well, Lord willing, I say us, Lord willing, I'm part of the elect as well. All right, but let me say it like this. Compared to the people around the elect, the elect are a very small number. And then you got individual states. And then even across the world, man, you know, for example, you know, but just using an example here in Babylon, for example, you might in one state, you might have, you know, you you know, you got you got a camp, you know, let's just use a camp, for example, you know, in one state, you might have a camp full of brothers, you know, like minded brothers teaching the doctrine that gym, that great millstone teaches. Right. And think about it, man. You know, it's, it's like, you know, they're the only ones in their state like that, in that state like that, you know. They're the only ones in the in their in their in the state in their state like that, you know. And you got brothers, you know, across the country, of course, you know, and around the world. But you know, just using you know a camp, you know, a handful of brothers in a state because it's not a lot. If you get what I'm trying to say, it's it's not a lot of people. Slack it, you know. It's let me say it like this: compared to the people around the elect, the elect are a small number, you know. You see. You know, so just think about it once again, you know, in a state, you know, there, um, you know, you have a lot of, you know, people, all right, but you only have, a, you know, a handful of men that teach the doctrine of the apostles, the elders, great millstone teach, you know, and so you only have a handful of, uh, you know, the elect brothers in a certain state, right? So when all hell breaks loose, okay, who do you think the women, you know, are going to run to it? Because these so-called high-value guys in this society, all right, they're, you know, they're, um, they're going to be getting killed. You know, let me get a scripture since I, you know, um, got that and stuff. All right, this is the book of Proverbs, chapter 11 and verse 4, and it says, Riches profit not in the day of wrath, but righteousness delivereth from death. 
right so riches don't profit riches you know don't benefit during you know in the day of wrath so these so-called high value men in this society so-called high value men and all hell breaks loose their their money social status and all that that's not going to benefit them it's not going to help them when all hell breaks loose all right because right, you know they, they won't have yahweh bahashim yahweh shah on their side and they won't have this knowledge wisdom and understanding all right so you know and plus they're going to be scared too and they're going to be dying as well because scriptures you know pretty much say how you know the men are going to be getting killed off and stuff all right but also too you know understand you know these women you know so so think about it right you know you may have a handful of brothers in a state okay and when all hell breaks loose you know it's 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 prophesied how you know multiple women are going to run to the men of the lord but slack let me build the point you know even more bear me just one second here please chapter 11 and verse 7 what then israel hath not obtained that which he seeketh for but the election hath obtained it and the rest were blinded precept matthew chapter 13 and verses 10 through 11 and the disciples came and said unto him why speakest thou unto them in parables verse 11 he answered and said unto them because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven but to them it is not given so the point i'm trying to make is this truth this wisdom knowledge and understanding is only given to a certain group you know a certain handful of um of uh people you know a certain handful of people man you know you know it's only for a certain certain handful okay not for the majority all right you know not for the majority man all right so you got to think about that Okay, a, a small number of men is going to have this truth compared to the rest of them around them, right? To the rest of the people, you know, to the rest of them, right? You know, so that's 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 not a big number, you know. I, you know, Slocky, I'm my mind is all over the place right now, man. You know, I am getting frustrated because one, I'm not making the trying to make the point, and then two. You know, this big ass fucking truck next to me, man. All right, stupid motherfucker. All right, but pretty much, you know, point being, there's not a lot of men that's going to, you know, that that had the truth in the world, and only a select few that actually have the true wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, right? And that's going to benefit them. You know, that this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, this truth is going to benefit. All right, you know the elect in the time of trouble, and Yahweh, and also the elect to have Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah on their side, man. All right, so that should even you know so that so that tells you that you know this handful of men, when all hell breaks loose, all right, they're gonna really be the prize, okay? You know they're gonna really be the prize, and guess what? So so let's so before we move on to the point right let's look at something the elect they had the truth they have you how about the Yahweh. customer requested Salak you here. hand them the order they added the following instructions hand it to me oh, i gotta see these people salakia just bear me just one 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 second man you know just out here doing something you know just uh Shah, bear me just one second please Shh, see these man Lock it.
a lot about that, all right? But um, yeah, the point I'm trying to make, you know, is so so thus far, right? Let's 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 analyze this, right? You got the elect that have Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shah on their side, all right? They got the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, right? And this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding is going to keep them stable in the time to come, right? You know, so check it out, right? Um, you know, so they have that, you know, and and you know, versus and versus these men in the world that don't, right? So when all hell breaks loose, these men in the world they're gonna be dying left and right, regardless of their social status. They're gonna be dying left and right, right? You know, <clears throat> so you know, and the elect Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh is gonna protect them. Okay, and let me just get a quick scripture, you know, because I had mentioned something, right? This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 33, and verse 6. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times, and strength of salvation, the fear of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai is his treasure, right? Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times. So this knowledge, wisdom, and understanding is going to keep the elect stable in the times to come. It ain't going to be freaking out like the next person, all right? And also, as I was saying, you know, the elect have Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai on their side. Psalms 33, verse, verses 16 through 20. There is no king saved by the multitude of an host. A mighty man is not delivered by much strength. And horse is a vain thing for safety. Neither shall he deliver any by his great strength. Behold, the eye of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai is upon them that fear him. Upon them that hope in his mercy to deliver their soul from death and to keep them alive in famine. Our soul waiteth for Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai. He is our help and our shield. So the elect, see, the elect have Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai on their side. You know? Not, you know, they don't trust in, you know, guns and ammunition and stuff like that, you see? And the Lord is going to protect them. You know, the Lord got the best track record, you know? Sirach 2 and 10. Look at the generations of old and see. The ever any trust in the Lord that was confounded or did any abide in his fear and was forsaken? Or whom did he ever despise that called upon him? The answer is none, no one. Verse 11, for the, you know, none of his, right? Verse 11, you know, nobody, you know, that, you know, the, pretty much the Lord was always there for his. You could look at the accounts of old, the stories of old in the scriptures, and you could see that the Lord was always there for his. Verse 11, for the Lord is full of compassion and mercy, long suffering and very pitiful. And forgiveth sins and saveth in time of affliction. You know? So the Lord is always there for his, right? So, you know. And also, too, the Lord is going to be giving his men spiritual power. So you got to think, right? So the point I'm trying to make is it's only a handful of men, okay? You know, just you once again, using a state, okay? Using, you know, certain, you know, brothers in a state. It's only a handful of brothers in a state, man, you know? Yeah, brothers may have large camps, but compared to all the people around them, all right, you know, they, um, you know, they're small in number, okay, which that doesn't mean anything just because they're small in number. That don't mean nothing. You know, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai is with brothers, okay? But compared to the people around, you know, brothers, you know, you know, it's a small handful. It's, you know, they're, they're, you know, compared to people around brothers in a particular state, you know, it's, it's just, you know, the, you know, brothers, you know, are, are um, outnumbered, you know, pretty much, right? So, when all hell breaks loose, okay, and these men, you know, in this society, you know, you know, regular men, all right, get, a kid, get killed left and right, you know, when they start dropping left and right, man, okay, you know, who do you think the women are going to run to? Because it is prophesied that the women are going to run, you know, to the elect, to an elect man, you know, let me get that, this is the book of, uh, so like, this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 4, and verse 1, and in that day, in what day, the time of Jacob's trouble, all right, Jeremiah 37, the last for that day is great, so that none is like it, it is even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it, and in that day, seven women, and this doesn't mean exactly seven, just means, you know, complete number, you know, complete number of women says shall take hold of one man and that and when you look at that word take hold in the hebrew it's kazak and the one that fits fits this um 
our scripture is, you know, pretty much pressing upon or being urgent. You know, they're going to be urgent to be with an elect man of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Okay, it says take hold of one man, not just every, not just um, you know, every um, not just any man, an elect man of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. You see, it's saying we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by thy name to take away our approach. So, men, women are going to flock to men, to the elect men. You got to understand this, man, because there's more women than men. So when these, you know, look, man, you know, if if these men out here are going to be dying, right, left and right, you know, because also too, these men are going to be getting drafted and things like that, you know. I get it. You know, these men are going to be getting drafted and stuff. Okay. Scriptures speak of a draft, all right. You know, but these men out here, they're going to be dying left and right. Okay, you know, and you know, so these women, they're gonna run to the men of the Lord. It's, it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be lots. And and, and the thing is, it's like let me, let me finish building the point. All right, these men are gonna be getting killed left and right, right. And then guess what? There's more women. Come on, bro. What the fuck, man? Bitch ass, man. <sighs> Fucking hate these dumb ass people. I look forward to seeing these people die left and right, man. I look forward to it. These people fucking stupid, man. All right? But there's more women than men, okay? You know? So think about that, man. Just use a, just using a state as an example. There's more women out here than men, okay? You know? It's, it's way more women out here than men, all right? And these women, it's prophecy that they're going to be, they're going to, you know, be urgent to be, with, be pressing upon a man of the Lord. You know to be with him, okay. You know they're they're gonna they're gonna uh, be pressing upon a man of the Lord to be with him. All right, so it's gonna be a lot of women that's gonna chase brothers down, man. You know, trying to get with him. You know when all hell breaks loose. You know they play this game of, you know, saying they don't want a man now, oh, but then that day they definitely gonna want a man, a man of the Lord. Okay, see the Lord's gonna, the elect already is the prize and have value, but it's just hidden. Isaiah chapter 13 and verse 12. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man in the golden wedge of Ophir. And who's going to make a man more precious than, than, fine, than fine gold? Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai. And what type of man? A man of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, an elect man. All right? You know, and the elect, they're going to be that fine, that, that fine gold, that, that the precious thing that's sought for because of the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding that they have. So do you see the pieces fitting together? You know, because that's that this this truth is going to be valuable in, in that time. Very valuable. It's valuable now. All right. But you're going you're gonna to have to rely on what you learn when all hell breaks loose. You see, and these women, they, they need guidance. OK, you know, they're going to need guidance and protection and all of that. You know, and the elect have these things. OK, you know, the elect have the, the, the wisdom, knowledge, understanding, you know, they get from these scriptures. Proverbs 2 and 7, Proverbs 2, verses 6 through 7. For Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai giveth wisdom. Out of his mouth cometh knowledge and understanding. He layeth up sound wisdom for the righteous. He is a buckler to them that walk uprightly. So in these scriptures, all right, the Lord, you know, has the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, which only the elect are going to get the true wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. They're going to get the truth. You see? Only and that's only for the elect, elect men. All right, you know that's only for the elect, man. All right, and I'm specifically focusing on the men, all right? Because you know you have sisters that understand, but you know I'm talking about the men, because the men are the ones the women are gonna run to. All right, you know they're not gonna be running to other women; they're gonna be running to, to the elect men for protection. All right, and guidance, you know, and also about the protection. Isaiah 32 and two. And a man, what man? A man of Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai shall be as an hiding place from the wind and a covert from the tempest, as rivers of water in a dry place, as a shadow of a great rock in a weary land. All right? This is, and, you know, so um, an elect man is going to be like a safe haven to these women when all hell breaks loose, man. Don't let these women, you know, fool you talking about they don't need no man. They just feel like that now because they can do it, you know, be Mrs. Independent. You know, even now when they can't, you know, when they struggle with bills and all that extra stuff, you know, they want a man to come in and save the day for them. You know? 
You see? But they it's really gonna have you know, these women are really gonna see how fucking uh needful they they're in and, and humble they're gonna be when all hell breaks loose. All right, they're gonna need protection, and the, and the Lord is gonna give His elect men spiritual powers to be able to protect the women He's with. All right, all right. So, you know, and, but hey, man, a lot of these women are gonna chase brothers down when all hell breaks loose, man. All right, a lot of these um, a lot of these women are gonna chase brothers down, man. All right, you know so. I just wanted to, you know, is maybe, you know, for, you know, brothers, it might be tough getting women right now, but <laughs> they're going to run to us, man. You know, they're going to run to us, you know, you know what I mean? <laughs> we the prize now. All right. But these women just don't see it. You know, just think of it like this, you know, think of it as, you know, you know, somebody, you know, walking right and walking past gold every day. You know, but the you know, but they don't know it. You know, the gold might be covered up. You know, maybe laying on the ground somewhere, but something might be covering over it. You know, for the time being, and they walking past looking for gold all day. You know, they don't see it because it's covered up. But but I you know, but once it's uncovered and they walk past it and see it, oh, best believe they're gonna run to it. And guess what, man? You know, that's that's us. That's us brothers, man. Lord willing, we be of the elect. We're that gold. We're the prize. Okay. It's just our value is hidden right now. You know, the elect's value is hidden. All right? I should say. All right? Currently. But it's, it's definitely going to be made known. It's prophecy that it's going to be made known. And we know the Lord don't lie. You know? So I just wanted to bring that out, man. Women are going to run after the elect. A lot of women. A lot of them. A lot of women are going to be dying. But a lot of women are going to run after brothers, man. You know, like the Apostle Elder Gabar said, all, all types of beautiful bitches are going to be running you down. All types, you know. Look, come on, let's think of it, brothers. We men, man. You know, um, light skin, uh, <laughs> dark skin women, short, tall, thick, you know, curly hair and all of that. They're gonna be chasing brothers down, man. <laughs> and you, you could you could take them if you want. You could reject them. You could reject them, and reject means to throw back. So when you reject them, it's like you're throwing them right back into the chaos, man. To go die with who else they're gonna be with a regular man he gonna die is, he, is she gonna die with him you know you see you know as the apostle other gabar said you can reject them you know you be like hey you know nah i don't like the way you look or you're too fat you know you're too tall you're too skinny you know like they do us all right so these times is coming you know all types of beautiful women man curly hair you know straight hair you know, women with an afro or something. And a lot of so-called black women are going to get refused, man. I, I could feel it, you know. The nigga, the nigga woman is through, okay? Through. T-H-R-U. You no know, matter of fact, through. <laughs> T-H-U-U. <laughs> through. You know what I mean? So, hey, brothers, keep your head up, man. We're the prize, right? And prophecy is, come, is going to come to pass. It's coming to pass, and it's going to, it's going to escalate even more. So Lord willing, this lesson was edifying and uplifting to the elect. I want to give all the praises, honor, and glory to whom rightfully belongs, which is Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Rachak Wadash. That belongs to the apostles and elders of great millstone every well. Peace, blessing, citations to the elect. And um, thought just came to mind one more thing. These women, they act like this also too because they got the so-called white man that they, that they could call to come help them. But once once he's out the way, these women, are, these, these women, you know, it's, <clears throat> They gonna find out, you know. Things are gonna change, brothers. So with that, stay strong. Shalom.